for me, being quite an adventurous person, I was like, I was very happy camping and, you know, doing all the outdoorsy stuff. And at the time when I booked with mum, I'm like, you know, you happy to camp? And she's like, yeah, yeah, I can camp. You know, she'd sort of seen the luxurious tents in, in outdoor shops, thinking that would be staying in one of them. But I think when she first arrived here, she was in a bit of a, she was in a state of shock. Camping together for nine nights in a tent, um, it was in sort of intense mother, and like sleeping next to my mother. I haven't done that since I was a baby. Um, and sort of putting the tent up, the teamwork, like going, working together as a team and looking after her. Sort of role reversal here when both of us are outside our comfort zone and I've got the advantage of being a little bit younger and, you know, I can speak the language um, a little easier than she can. Um, so really sort of looking out for her and making sure that she's okay. Um, yeah, it's, like, I feel like at the, I have grown up, but I've also lost a little bit of my independence at the same time. It's, it's a weird feeling. I think every single morning when she wakes up before I do and just goes, right, we're ready to go. And just her, energy and passion for, for this trip and sort of her hunger to see new things. It's been really encouraging and, and so that moment when she sort of, you know, sticks her face in my face in the morning has been really good and it's kept me going and I think, yeah, we sort of spur each other on. I mean, having said that, as much as I love travelling with mum, I don't think I can do it again. <laughs>